Hello, Europe. This is David calling from Canada. So today's topic is Germany and Eurovision 2019. So Germany first started back in the very first year of 1956. They've actually been every single year except for once in the 90s when they didn't qualify for the finals before they were part of the Big Five. So, saying that, Germany is part of the Big Five so they automatically qualify for the finals. So Germany's best result was first place back in 1982 and 2010. Their worst result was last place in quite a few years, back in 1964, 1965, 1974, 1995, 2005, 2015, and 2016. So some of my favorites, so Germany is one of my favorite countries in Eurovision, has been back in 1970, 1971, 1980, 1981, 1982, 1985, 2001, so that's Michelle. Michelle is one of my favorite German singers. I love her career. One of my favorite songs from Michelle is Paris. I love that song. I love it. I thought she should have done better in the contest. I thought she should have won that year. So 2010, Selena, I've followed her career ever since she won, so of course I love 2011 as well. So Alina is very talented, I love her new music, she just came out with some new music this year, so you should check it out. As well as 2013, so Cascada, so she's probably one of the fam most famous German-British singers that has crossed over internationally. So she had... A few really good hits here in Canada, so um, What Hurts the Most, Every Time We Touch, Back with the Dance Floor. So she is very popular still. So that song, I don't know why it did so poorly in the contest. It was one of the best songs that year, and I still listen to it all the time. And I also like 2015. So this year, the song is called Sister, and the singer's names are Sisters. So I'm not sure if they're actually sisters in real life. One is blonde, one has brown hair, one's darker skin, one's more fair skin. So I don't think they are actually sisters, but who knows? It might just be the band name. So the song is called Sister. What do I think of this song? I'm not too sure about this one. It has grown on me quite a bit. I really thought Allie Ryan should have won this year with her song Where Your Love. It is such a fun, catchy song. I actually thought this song was from the Ukraine because I was watching the Ukraine finals as well as the German finals around the same time. It wasn't the same like week I watched it, but I thought she was from the Ukraine because it was such a Ukrainian sound to it, but it was actually a German singer. So I thought, oh, wow, this song should have won for sure, but it, I think it got in second last in the national finals for Germany. So she did bring out another song and I absolutely love it. She's a great singer. If she went into the contest, I think she could have gotten into the top five. So I really wish they would have brought Ali Ryan instead of Sisters. But I do like this song. So did I give this song out of 10? I gave this song a 7 out of 10. So it wasn't my favorite. It was an okay song. It has grown on me so much, and they do have powerful vocals. How well will they do in the finals? I think they will probably be closer to the last place position. But, again, look at how I usually rate things. A song I think is going to do last place usually gets in the top five. A song that I think is going to get in the top five usually gets closer to the last place. So, Germany automatically gets to the finals. So, what do you think Germany will do in the finals? How well do you think they'll do? As well, what do you rate them out of 10? Love to hear from you in the comments below. Thank you for watching. If you like my video, please like, share, subscribe. Bye.